Right, geology is the study of rocks, and all rocks are made up of ingredients that we call minerals. Now each mineral is a particular arrangement of atoms to form a nice crystal. In this case, this pink, pink mineral here is a mineral called tourmaline, and the variety is called rubellite. And the reason it has nice crystals is because the atoms within it arrange in a regular framework. And the atoms vary from mineral to mineral, and the way they fit together isn't the same when you can try to combine different atoms together. The frameworks are different shapes, and so we have different crystal shapes. But the mixture of minerals that form a rock is also variable. So certain minerals will form a rock called granite, and that would be a mineral called quartz, a mineral called mica, and usually a mineral called feldspar, whereas other minerals will form other rocks. For example, basalt. Basalt will be minerals including feldspar, again, but this time a slightly different feldspar, and darker minerals, hornblende, and, and usually a pyroxene mineral called augite or augite. So different minerals combine together to make different rocks. And the study of geology is about understanding the differences between those rocks and interpreting how they formed because of those differences.